Right now, we just got out of church. Um, we went to church without power, so it was a really cold church, and now we're at uh, Costco right now, where they're kind of, I think they're still running on generator, because um, there's still no electricity coming from the power lines. And that's my niece and nephew. <laughs> Anyways, we're at Costco, and instead of having like samples of regular massage table, <laughs> Instead of having like a regular sample that they like have from the burners or have microwave, they all have just like non-cooked samples like trail mix and bread. regular bread with um, butter on it. But yeah, we're just gonna pick some stuff up and then head to my cousin's house again because we're still hanging out there. Even though I still have power at home, my other cousin right there doesn't have power still. And we're just hanging out and kicking it, so. Hey guys, so I just got out of a coffee shop, um, the same place that I went to a week and a half ago. Now I'm headed to Home Depot because my side mirrors on my car is like falling off. And I'm not trying to use duct tape to put it back together because that's hella ghetto. And I'm not trying to spend super, like a, an insane amount of money just to get it um, fixed by the manufacturer. So I talked to my uncle who works on cars and he said the cord that's connected to the mirror, the electronic mirror, to the car is still intact, it's just like the hardware needs to be uh, glued back together and he suggested buying gel based super glue and sanding down kind of the edges that where it cracks so that there are no like kind of rivets. So let me show you what it looks like. So it looks like that. It's like basically almost fallen off. So heading to Home Depot for that. So this is, this is the situation. Um, the rear view mirror fell off or got cracked off once I um, kind of backed it into my gate accidentally so have um, kind of a sand block with um, some gel based super glue and I'm going to sand the white parts. You're just trying to sand it I guess just to get it to um, be as smooth as can be. Probably going to gel it together. I'll probably get this part first. Oh shit. I hope I don't glue my like hands at all. And it, I guess you're supposed to hold it for 15 seconds. At least it's not as ghetto as having like gray duct tape. Hey guys, so right now I'm in downtown with this hoe. Hi. Um, her eyes are dilated right now because I have to take her to the eye doctor. <laughs> And, and it's blurry. And it's blurry, but in return, she's buying my lunch and paying for my parking. <laughs> Thank you. But anyways, we're in downtown Seattle right now. We're probably going to go shopping. Um, we went to the thrift store earlier, so I might do a thrift store haul. I've never really gone thrifting before, but um, I got a few good things today, and they were really, really cheap. Like, wow. But anyways, um, half, off. half off off of the thrift store price. The Steelhead Diner and I have to point the menu this far for Crystal to read because her eyes are still dilated. Um, we're at this place called the Steelhead Diner. It's at Pike's Place Market in downtown Seattle. Really nice view outside usually but right now um, it's really cloudy and overcast. But, um, really nice place. Got some bread with some butter and pesto. Yeah. I'm still deciding what to get. <laughs> can, you, can you read it clearly? She's like three feet away from the menu. This hoe couldn't wait, but we have chicken quesadillas. Um, there used to be four, but now there's three because she's... Oh. Okay, she's eating right now. <laughs> she's getting mad because I have to videotape her food before she eats it and she's impatient. But she got, what'd you get? Buttermilk chicken sandwich. And I got um, catfish tacos. As you can see, the snow, the snow is almost gone, but I'm gonna go walk to the hair salon because I live super close to this Vietnamese hair salon. Whatever you like, we do for you, but <laughs> um, I'm gonna get my get a haircut because it's looking all toe up, and yeah. Hey guys, so right now I'm at Crystal's house. Uh, we're filming both the thrift store haul and our favorites of the month of January slash December slash November, but um, She's here Hi. too. This is our ghetto ass setup. We got like the curtains to diffuse the light a bit, and then we got a little <laughs> the can of fudge. <laughs> the can. It's not mine. The can of fudge stand <laughs> to put our camera, and then we got you know little pixie here. She was in the video pixie. too, 
And yeah, the little favorites. So yeah, talk to you guys later. We're probably gonna go eat after this. Yes, I have an interview in a few hours, but you better not make me laugh. <laughs> It's He's a kicking me out. Yeah, I'm kicking I'm her not out. Allowed. And of her own house, okay. So right now we're at the mall and it's really dead because it's a Thursday and we went shopping. I think all of the items that we got were accessories. <laughs> we're going to Nordstrom now. Right there. We're probably gonna go get something to eat at Nordstrom Cafe because we're a little gutum. What does that mean? Hungry. In Tegalug. <laughs> Um, new day, and I think I'm gonna go be playing tennis um, later today because it's super sunny outside. I don't know if you can see. Well, there's blinds there, but right now I'm gonna string my tennis racket. Got some strings right here, and my brother's tennis racket stringer. Um, gonna do that really quick, and probably hit with a friend later. So. So right now, me and my friend Hoa, say hi. Hi. Uh, we just uh, hit some tennis balls for a little bit. I think. Um, you got shape. I'm out of shape. <laughs> I I mean I, I mean my strokes are still there, right? Yeah. But it's just like my stamina and my endurance. But um, later, Hoa's having a birthday party at his house, so maybe I'll take my camera along. Yeah. Okay. Okay, maybe you'll see us at his house later today. Okay, bye. So I don't know if you guys can actually see me, but I'm driving to this place called Ken Station where I'm supposed to meet my friend Elsie, who you've seen in a previous vlog video, but her boyfriend, who is normally out of town um, because he goes to school maybe five hours away from where she lives in Seattle, um, is coming to surprise her. Um, because he's here for the weekend. So we're gonna go eat and he's gonna surprise her at the restaurant. Um, and we've kind of been coordinating with him, or I've been coordinating with him to, um, so that she can, or he can meet us there. And then we're all gonna go to that party that I mentioned earlier um, when I was playing tennis. So we'll see you there soon, bye. Hi, the camera. What are we doing today? We're gonna bar hop in Kent Station. Bar hop in Kent Station, what, what? <laughs> Were you wondering why I was looking at my phone so much? Yeah! <laughs> and you're like, you are so rude, Jerome. You should not start, stop being on the phone. And people were thinking that I was her date? No. <laughs> say, say, say hi, Josh. Hi. This is Elsie's boyfriend. Came all the way from Pullman, which is five hours away. It feels good. Like, you know me. I don't get surprised. You don't? So we moved to another bar called... Mama Stortini's and this is my boyfriend Josh. Hi, I'm boyfriend Josh. Boyfriend Josh. Elsie. So right now I'm at this house party. My friend's so bad. Hello. Hello. Elsie and Josh there, and then everybody back there. Hi. 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 Uh, we've only I've only had one drink. I've been here for like ten minutes so far, and I'm sure it'll only get more packed in here. Oh. More crazy. I was gonna say you probably remember Sopak from the Madrid, the Madrid uh, videos. You know I posted on Facebook, or on uh, YouTube, on my channel. Yeah, that's me. Some of my my uh, followers, the subscribers, really like you. You should read the comments. Yeah. So um, yeah, we need another um, ex uh, vacation slash journey. We yeah. do, we do in Italy next. That'd be awesome. Tell me what this is. Kettle corn, but at home without a kettle and corn. So what do you do to it? So you take popcorn in the bag, but like but like press down. Yeah. So you pop it in the microwave. Yeah. And then you put five scoops of sugar, and then you shake it like this. <laughs> and then it's kettle corn. Oh. Kettle corn. What up? I want some kettle corn. Kettle. Oh. oh. <laughs>
Paula, happy birthday. Hey, Deb, I know you're, you're vlogging. I am. So happy birthday to me. Thanks for coming. I love you. Hey guys, so right now I just got done playing tennis with my brother and I'm hungry and I think he's hungry too so we're gonna go grab uh, food from this Chinese place called Green Village um, and then later on tonight, I'll probably take you guys with me, we're going to our cousin's um, 22nd birthday kind of dinner at this place called Wild Wings. Buffalo Wild Wings. I don't know if it's like a franchise. They have different locations around the US. It's basically like a chicken wing place. They have different type of wings and they just opened one um, nearby so we're gonna go there um, later tonight. This is the place where we are to get food. Smoking it right there. And there's a big Buddha <laughs> with a Hawaiian lei. <laughs> Hey guys, so right now we're driving. Oh, that's how you do it. <laughs> oh yeah, I have a stand here. Wow. That's actually uh, cool though. That's actually well, cool. I, I just, I'm just having it stand, but you can actually de um, retract it and detract it so that it... So Is that made for that? No. It's made for GPS. But anyways, we're going to Buffalo Wilds. You saw Alan before. Um... Yeah. It's my birthday. It's his birthday. By the way, we ended up not going to Buffalo Wilds because it was too um, crowded there. So we ended up going to Hooters. And this is what I got. I got the 20 piece. 10 pieces is um, the honey garlic. No, 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 I'm sorry. The honey Thai. And the other 10 pieces is the parmesan. Close-up view of the cupcake. It looks like a Oreo. Thank you. Oreo frosting with um, chocolate and peanut butter um, cake. And I think there's a, an Oreo on the bottom. So. So right now we're at H&M, and my cousin Alan was looking through the clothes, and he goes, he sees this, and he goes, "Oh, is it Angry Beavers?" No, Alan. It's a pineapple. Good one. <laughs> it was funny at the time. <laughs>